So hey what's going on everyone this is called Gadeske and this video we is going to be a great one because this video we are going to implement convolution neural network and TensorFlow and Python and we will be making binary image classification and image will be given as a picture of a dog uh, or a cat. So first of all we are adding the libraries so uh, we are using TensorFlow so we are add a uh, start from uh, import TensorFlow as a TF and uh, now we are add uh, tensorflow dot layers and curl dot layers and uh, import uh, convert 2d activation and uh, platen and the uh, max pooling and platen so there are multiple layers now we are uh, add dot tensorflow dot yeah dot keras dot callbacks callbacks uh, import the model checkpoint comma early stop now from Tensorflow Tensorflow dot Keras preprocessing dot image and import image data generator image data generator now from Tensorflow dot keras and models the model will be sequential because we are uh, add our own uh, model you can use a uh, different models uh, like uh, vgg uh, exceptions uh, resnet and much more and if you want to make on model so you just write a model sequential now we are uh, using matplotlib matplotlib uh, uh, basically used for uh, groups uh, uh, the accuracy will that they will uh, give us uh, the result uh, as a graph uh, so we are uh, using that now so now here we will add uh, the data set path the train and uh, we have two path the train and testing so we are right uh, first of all we are add the train path there is a directory the dog image there's a train directory we are past here and now the test directory we should fast here now the image size size is equal to will be 224 and now the the step is a data augmentation We are named that data gen. So we are write image data generator and the scale is equal to one dot two fifty five. It means uh, the picture size uh, pixels will be zero to two fifty five. There are two fifty six pixels, so it will uh, de detect all the pixels, and the shear range uh, will be. When I was used at uh, 20%, so I was right at 0.2, and the uh, zoom range will be 20%. Zoom range means that uh, image will be zoomed 20%, just like that. So I just write uh, 0.2, and now the validation split and uh, 20%. It will be randomly select from train data 
uh, 20% images uh, as a validation part and the other 80% for training there is the uh, x train we are uh, use data gen and training you will use the data expectation only for training image now for our testing so i just write a flow prep directory and there is the train the target size will be we are using the size so you just write help size comma size and uh, batch size will be 32 and the class mode will be categorical and the subset will be training now for uh, x test is equal to image data generator the uh, rescale is equal to one dot um, uh, 255 dot uh, flow from directory and we are and just uh, add the test and we will copy that and past here make uh, and the sequence we are going to sequence in our code so now it's okay So now the next step will be callback setup so we are uh, add uh, the checkpoint is equal to model checkpoint and here we will add uh, the path of our uh, model save path so i just name here pet model dot hwap hwap used for uh, tensor pro keras our training model will be saved here the monitor it will monitor validation loss and mode will be minimum and save best only it will be true and the war bus will be one because uh, uh, it will give us uh, 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 one output and there will be a list of early checkpoint so here will be monitor validation loss it will be and uh, main data will be zero and patient C will be I'm uh, at 50 because uh, it depends upon your epoch so if you have used more than 70 100 so you just use 40 patient C uh, it will uh, if for the accuracy will not increase in port box it will be automatically stop so the callbacks will be is equal to the um, checkpoint and a list of so now the next step will be our model cnn cnn model so here we are start uh, from our model model is equal to sequential model dot add convert to d 
that's the first layer and 64 filters and the kernel size will be 3 cross 3 I will be explain that later in another video that all uh, CNN model and step by step so don't be worried and the activation ReLU and the padding size will be same and the input shape will be size comma size comma 3 3 for RGB because we are using RGB images and the model or add there will be max pooling layer max pooling 2d and the kernel size will be 2 cross 2 now here the second layer model dot add convert 2d and uh, i am also using here 64 you can use different filters and the kernel size 3 cross 3 and activation uh, using relu and the padding will be same and input shape uh, uh, only compulsory in post layer not in other layers and there will be uh, we are adding the max pooling layer again so now we are copying here and post here again and change the filters 32 and we are copy again and past here there will be four we are making four layers the first will be 64 64 32 and 32 so now we are using the platen it will uh, um, all the filters uh, size will be one dimensions the all and now here we will add uh, the dense layer the dense layer uh, we are using uh, 192 and the activation will be real and the last year model dot add dense so we are two classes so we are add uh, two and activation will be sigmoid sigmoid used for binary class and the softmax will be used for multiple classes and we have used uh, two classes so uh, here we are write two and uh, the model compile and the optimizer will be tf dot keras dot optimizers dot uh, adam we are using adam optimizer and the learning rate will be 0 0.001 and loss will be categorical cross entropy in the matrix it will give the accuracy so now model dot model summary it will give the model summary now the next step will be uh, about the history so here history is equal to model dot fit x is equal to x train and the validation And the validation data is equal to x test to so the epochs epochs is equal to we are using 70 epochs here 
स्टेप्स पर एपॉक जीगल टू एक्स ट्रेन डॉट सैंपल्स एंड द बेच साइज थर्टी टू एंड वेलिडेशन स्प्लिट सो रिवेलिडेशन स्टेप्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स टेस्ट डॉट सैंपल्स एंड द बेच साइज and in last uh, callback is equal to callbacks so now it's okay let's just uh, run and check out let's see what give us so here finally it will be run there will be the images or uh, we are using 25000 images so 5000 for validation and 25000 for training and the 7500 for testing we are using 30% images for testing 80% for training and 20% for validation and there is the a model summary of all our model there will be total parameters non and non non parameters will be zero there will be the time given the first fox at uh, the equation will be increased slowly slowly and the giving time will be tw almost 27 minutes it depends upon your system if you have more than faster system so it will be less time and if you have used G more faster gpu it will be more faster than classification so it will be running equals it will be slowly increase so hopefully you will be learn from that video uh, keep like subscribe